How did all of this make you feel? I mean, you you expected to be this person who's happy, Umam Ruti and all of this stuff, and and you're going through so much. Didn't that erode anything in you, maybe, even your self-worth? You know what it does? It strips you off your confidence and your self-esteem. Even as a person who's very good at what you do, you are bound to actually drop the standard of your work because mm -hmm. of what is happening psychologically, what is happening behind closed doors of what seems to be a perfect family. You see, mm. so it, it, it makes you go to no muses on twenty. You'd rather I remember to my prescription because um mang it's mang shy we sometimes being born a little bit read. So I remember to la ama ama this prescription classes that are tinted, so that, so that even if no mang shy we. That was the first time I actually used makeup. You know, not this mm. beautiful makeup that you see. <laughs> you know, yeah, we <laughs> but, but but that makeup that I used then was not to beautify myself, but Ugvala I'm a Max, so that people don't see me. Because, in fact, I felt ashamed that I'm the one who did anything wrong. Mm. And, and I think one of the reasons that made me to feel ashamed is because even if you were to reach out and say, this is what I'm going through. People won't believe you. They put mfundis. Because, um, so yeah, yeah, because what know? I'm trying to understand is it must have also maybe caught you by surprise because you are married to a mfundisi. True. You, these things you don't expect that a mfundisi no, will do. And so when it happens, sometimes it becomes a situation that just really paralyzes your your ability and you're to a actually. young girl for heaven's sake age 21 22 23 24 25 like what do you know about marriage i've never experienced this in my own parents mm. you know you know i i i it 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 became such an overwhelming experience and looking at this person with this person is a minister i also have to protect his own his, image. Uh, yeah, because I wanted to come up with, didn't that come with lots of treasure though? You were yeah. young and some of these people that are expecting you to be this strong woman are sometimes even some of them twice your age. In fact, others are older than my grandmother, you know. Mm. And mm. Um, uh, unfortunately, this is what I had observed, even in the church itself. Um, people within the church, the congregants would go out of their way to make sure they push you out when I'm am from DC, off the church mm. so that they can occupy your position, your position. because to mm. them, it's, a, it's like you're table. You right? Like, boy, now everything <laughs> is fine. Not knowing the, cha the, the challenges and the pains and the tears and the sweat and the blood that mm. goes through behind closed doors, closed doors. you know. Yeah. And uh, it, it happened, you know, there was this incident that really made me decide, which you know what, um, this is enough. It was in 2008, on the 15th of December, when he was already having an affair with our congregant, Wabumfundis. Umama walendomba zana tandana na esontweni is my executive in church. So wow. this woman reports to me, Umama. Oh, what did Mama give me? Yeah, yeah. You know, because they respect to go to you are uh, the Mamfundis. Exactly in this case. by virtue of you being married to the Mamfundis, yes. right, the Reverend? Yes. And she knows about the affair of Danake, Nendo Tayami. Then, and there's a lot of things that were happening besides her who should be calling and insulting me. And when I come this side in Johannesburg because we were mm. in Devon to visit, she would send and leave the evidence, your condom, mm. and leave the evidence, you know, mm. and, and she was already marking her territory in my territory. When um, I would find my messages, because I said, I will mix it then. Yes, yes, yes. And my husband would say uh, to, to her, I would a message. And Nitole, and you know, sometimes I would not even be angry. I remember that particular day, I laughed and I said, this is like, why am I 
and just go on with your life instead of using lies. Yes, yes. You know? Because I wanted to come to that to saying, do you think he was doing this thing to inf intentionally to inflict pain on you? Or he was just going through a period where he was just, he's lost. Because sometimes people say, do not worry about what people are, how would people treat you? That actually says more about who they are as, pe as a person. Yeah, I mean, you're saying it now, but at the time when you, it was you happening, think. you wouldn't think of such things. Mm -hmm. All you think about is there's people who are saying, get out, and you are like, hey, hang on. Chain. This person who was not like this, uzo change. I mean, nyamaz wababantonabam uzo change. And the situation is becoming worse and worse to a point of you having to almost experience death in the mm. hand of of that person, this person. Um, mm. you know, um, on the 15th of December, 2008, of course, there's this uh, affair that is already happening. And um, then there is the ex thing that you're and, getting. Yes. And, and, and now, Gunale affair, and I, yeah. and yes, yes, she's affair, but hey, it's very nice. It's hot, you know, the relationship. And goes. already I'm aware of which very good in Domazani in the picture, but my being a lady did not allow me to go and fight. Aww. There has been a confrontation when a lady, that lady denied everything. Yes. And the youth members were aware of everything. It's like people in the church knew, only I didn't know. <laughs> and I ended up finding out. And when I approached this mother, Umama and and she denied everything and she was all pretentious, you know? And this man, on that particular day, Sister Deben, one of our friends, Jesus was uh, next to Yagubo, la mm. so it is on 10. And uh, I think God had sent that guy to come and save my life on that particular day. Because out of the blue, he's never been to the beach. And on that day, this man, yeah. you know what kids do? They just want to. Yeah. Hello, everyone has to say what. And I look at Oshumta, Umtana Asondela, Umtana Bega Sesemani, Alessos Cat, you know. And we had another newborn baby, like a Sesemani or second born that time. Mm. And Marafi Umtana Azotla and I, Yabona Upu Tilona, Umbunisa something at TV. Then we are Mambane, News Umtana screamer, like they go down the passage, Yabon. Which why I'm disturbed in Alumun to but Mina as I come in Landela, Nganaklila Gamer, Ulachelumtana against the wall, right? Umbambinjin and cook like this. Um push her against the wall. Mara Pagam Mumtana wam shang and win them low men. And I came in there, the child was bleeding. So this was a fairly uh, an openly and unashamedly uh, violent person. Very, very and in front of people he was so perfect. And and behind closed doors, Mina Nabandwana, we were experiencing this, you know. Mm -hmm. And twice, people, one member of his family has experienced him like that. And she left and never came back. But this particular day, Mang Bona, this, I'm like, you know what, dude, you've always been doing this, mm -hmm. not with my child. For the first time, I was like, I'm going to fight you. And I fought him back. When he realized mm -hmm. that I was overpowering him, and Abantana already they are hysterical. Yes. He goes, you land in Bazo. Like an ex. If I did not scream and Umantla did not come as Ulanda Le Ambazo, uh, I don't know what would have happened. But here's another one. Sure. On that very same day, a situation here calmer. The mother in me says the children are already traumatized. Sure. Yes. Yes. But as if nothing has happened. And I mm. give them hugs and I reassure them and I tell them that I love them. I go to the main bedroom. So you're going back to the main bedroom. The main bedroom. You get told you you'd the, never leave your bedroom for anything. This is the space where you could wake up dead. If, if, I don't know if there is. Mind a you, say. you. I don't know if you're a prophet, but that's what is supposed to happen. So, Lele, I'm thinking the situation is now calm. I was Of course, Anglela ngobchongo because ingondo ilogia tabanga. You know, and something says, open your eyes. Mangvula Mesho, Ula, La, like here, Nembas. Ekapen Wakatuya Kapa, that's when I turned. 
and then he missed. And he missed. And I, oh. I screamed to a point this guy, and I opened the Ifa Stera and uh, uh, one of my, my neighbors who was Indian to call the police. But mm. even all the incidents, he would never get arrested. They will tell you, Kumfundisi. Mm.